Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to be using one of the jelly prints that I made in my recent jelly print video. And I cut it down to uh, the size to fit into my art journal. So I'm going to be putting this in here. And once I have the background down, I'm going to be adding something that I um, I drew the other day for a challenge in an art group that I'm in. The challenge was to draw a hand tangle, basically a zentangle pattern after you've traced around your hand. So I traced around my hand and mine is not really so much of a zentangle as it is a doodling, <laughs> but I doodled in the fingers and in the thumb. And then I found a picture of this cute little owl on the internet, so I decided to draw the owl in the um, in the bottom part of the hand. So that's what I did, and I thought it would look kind of cool um, inside the art journal. And so I just chose this pic, uh, this background that I did with fall colors to kind of blend in with the colors that are in the owl. So first, we'll get the background in. with a new day. This is all dry now. And I'm just going to outline the hand and add a little quote and probably call it done. We'll see. Okay, so we'll get started.
So there it is, the finished journal page. It's really simple. Just used a jelly print for the background. And I just wanted to show you guys how simple that is to do. You know, just make your jelly prints and then you go, hmm, what am I gonna do with those? And that's, that's what you do. You just put it down and then you can stamp on it. You can collage on it. You can draw on it. You can just write on it. And um, it just makes a simple, but you know, really nice looking page. So give it a try. I'll probably take the ink pad and go around the edges here too. Um, I guess I could do that now. I didn't really think about it until just, just this minute. So we'll use the stays on black. You know, if you don't have an ink pad, you can use black paint. You can just put a little on your finger and go around the edges. So it's all pretty doable. And it's not as hard as we convince ourselves that it is. A lot of times we, like I said before in another video, we, we get in our heads too much, you know? So we have to just not think about it and just do it. And I'm as guilty as everybody else too. I get all up in my head and think, I don't know what I'm going to do with this page. And, but we don't have to. Just it's as simple as gluing down the jelly print, gluing down the picture. And this picture doesn't have to be something you've drawn. A picture you put on can be something you've cut out of a magazine, you know, or, or something a child has drawn for you. Um, anything that you like, you can glue it down to a journal page. It's just that simple. I'm trying to get this corner here without making a mess. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. I don't want to get it all over the other pages in my journal. Okay, I think that's good. See how that just kind of sets off the page and it really kind of frames it and makes the colors pop. Looks really awesome. Okay, so that's it. A simple journal page for today. And um, so thank you for joining me. And as I've said before, art is fun stuff. So keep coming back and let's make stuff together. Bye, you guys.